Today we are delivering for Just Eat. I haven't delivered on Just Eat in over a year now. The last time I did it, the earnings were pretty good, better than the other delivery apps, but there were problems. And so we have a three hour shift. It's a Friday evening from four to 7 p.m. Is the earnings still good? Are we gonna have the problems we were having last time? And is it worth doing Just Eat? Is it worth doing deliveries in 2024? We're gonna find out. Alrighty guys, we have our first order. It took about eight minutes to come in. So I was waiting for just a little bit of time. We're picking up from a dessert place called Heavenly Desserts, which is just up here next to McDonald's. Brother, brother. Oh, hi. Is that, is how much? How, how much is this? Yeah. Uh, it's a GoPro, it's like a few hundred pounds. Uh, 50? Maybe like three, four hundred pounds, maybe five hundred. Uh, five hundred. Depending on the GoPro. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Alright, no worries. Alright, so picking up from this dessert place. Oh, smells sweet in here. <laughs> Can I get uh, Latoya's Just Eat? Yeah. That's alright. These are chocolate buttons. Hustler, yeah? yeah, yeah, How man. You? How are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> it's you. Yeah? That is me. Yeah, That's yeah. <laughs> then people think it's easy to make videos. They don't know the editing, cutting. Oh stuff. man, it takes forever. Like, yeah, but you do a nice job. Yeah, keep going. Yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, what, what was your name? Mohammed. Mohammed. Yeah. Jay. Yes. <laughs> See ya. It smells really sweet. <laughs> yeah. He literally just got out like a massive tub of chocolate buttons. Yeah. And he's melting them in there right now. Oh, <laughs> uh, enjoy. Yeah, cheers. Uh, this one. Perfect, thank you. So this customer is 11 minutes away, 1.7 miles. And the pay is looking good. I do have a one pound bonus on every single order that you get with this shift. They've given that to me probably because it's a Friday and they need people to deliver. Ah. Mohammed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, we need to inspect the, you know, the, the, road, the roads. Yeah. Yeah, what we done. You got an order? Yeah. All right, man, take care. Maybe, maybe. Do you, do you, do you mind? I don't mind. Yeah. Okay. Nice, yeah. uh, you, you'll be in there. Nice <laughs> yeah, like uh, this one is uh, Just Eat Shift. Okay. What is it like in 2024? Do you work for Just Eat or? No, but I think Deliveroo like stuff is going down. It's not very good. Not good anymore, yeah. And Uber Eats? Same, same. They give you three pounds for two miles. Yeah, yeah. I complain. Just Eats uh, giving me quite a bit for this one. Just Eats better. Yeah, this one is coming up to about almost six pounds for 10 minutes away. But... It's good, yeah. Six pounds is good. You make it a meal. But I only get one shift in the entire week. Oh. That's the problem. Need, for me, Uber is not good. Uber and the flu, they're going down. They're going down. Yeah. yeah. There's too many people doing it. Big companies, they get greedy. But there's also just too many people doing it. That's the problem, yeah. yeah. And now the summer's here, the students will start going. That's and it. there'll be less orders. All right, man. See you, see you later. There's riders everywhere. <laughs> how, how fast is your bike? It's going like 30 miles. 30 miles per hour? Don't don't do that. Yeah, he's not doing that. <laughs> so his bike goes uh, up to 30 miles per hour, as do most of the people doing this work on uh, the electric bikes uh, but he's a sensible lad he's not going to be doing that whereas some some will be doing that and i've seen them rock it around nottingham but anyways let's go deliver this order and well i kind of told you what we're going to get paid but uh let's see how this goes and how it goes very nice lad he said he's from tunisia he's been doing this for three years and you can tell he's been in the UK for a while because his English is pretty good. But uh, we're, right now we're going through, I think it's Alfreton Road. Yeah, this is Alfreton Road. You can see another delivery guy here.
انت موتي انا بيجي بيجي اقرب يا رجل Hi, it's uh, Latoya. Yeah, it's Latoya. <laughs> These guys are just coming out of the house. Okay. All right, there you go. Have a good weekend. Bye. Alrighty, guys. So we made five pound fifty-seven, which is really nice. We have that one pound boost, and that was like took me like eight minutes to deliver that obviously you have to bear in mind you're waiting so we did wait like almost 10 minutes for the order now when we actually delivered that order i was gonna you know start riding and then i started seeing you know look at all the rubbish just on the street everywhere it's like <laughs> it's not good even this window here has just got newspapers across the the windows here but uh yeah I don't know why there is so much rubbish just all around my bike. Just over here, you can see just Fanta cans, Seven Up, and yeah. I mean, probably the area I'm in, but still, like, it's, it's not very nice. Just wanted to show you that, guys. So let's head back into the city and pick up some more orders. Hopefully, we're not waiting for too long. Okay, uh, we have made it into the city, as you can see. And we've made £5.57 and it's been 40 minutes of the first hour, which if it goes on like this, then we're looking at minimum wage. And we even have that boost, that one pound boost. So it's not looking too good, not looking too good, but still a bit early on a Friday night, maybe around five, six, seven p.m. it'll start picking up. You can see here is where all the delivery guys are waiting just over here. And we have got an order from McDonald's. Haven't delivered a McDonald's one in a while. Hopefully the drink doesn't spill, but the fact that they're all waiting over there is not a good sign. Not a good sign at all. And just gotta be careful. It is gonna be very busy for footfall because it is a Friday. So we've made it to McDonald's. We've got a popo there. And usually I lock up my bike to this gate over here to make it faster for me to go to the customer. That's I've got the I've got 6009. Cheers mate. Right, Thank you. Shit, mate. I forgot how busy it is here at McDonald's. Cheers, mate. Oh, it feels a little bit claustrophobic picking up from McDonald's. So a bird just pooed on my battery. It literally just missed my head by a fraction. But we better get to the customer. No messing around with pigeon poop. So this customer is 11 minutes away, 1.4 miles. And I'm going to ask if they got a tissue to wipe off the pigeon poop. I literally missed my head. I've got a helmet on, but still, I, uh, I don't really want to be rocking around with some, some poop on my bike. Hopefully the customer will be <laughs> understanding. Look how green it is in this park. Got to be careful of the dogs. But uh, we're going to be going down pretty quickly. Literally blooming with green. This grass hasn't been cut. <laughs> and the trees just caught my attention how green it was. I don't know if it's the same for you guys. Maybe this is bad commentary. Let's just get to the customer, see if they got a tissue. <sighs> nice room doorbell. Oh yeah, it's uh, Tina. Yeah. Awesome. Get this out for you. You don't by any chance have a tissue. A pigeon's taken a, a dump on my bike. <laughs> Give me a minute. Yeah, I'd be appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> awesome, nice saver. Thank you so much. Thank have a good weekend. You. Bye. All right, let's get rid of this. Kind of like try it on now. 
Oh, I think that's come off now. Yeah, there we go. There we go. I will uh, just chuck that in the bin. So Tina was a very nice customer. I think that was her name. I'm in Heisen Green, so I was a little bit worried about asking because it can be a bit of a dodgy area. But we did make £5.61, which brings our... Thank you. Which brings our total to £11.18, and it's literally just gone five. So just under minimum wage, which I'd say is better than Deliveroo and Uber Eats, but still not minimum wage. On my way back into the city, and we've got another order from the same McDonald's. And uh, we're going to be careful here. I got a stare from the window <laughs> to back off. But um, I must say the Just the app is a lot less clunkier. It's actually quite nice to use now. Still, I wouldn't say as good as Deliveroo, but it seems a lot smoother, a lot more kind of user friendly is the word to use. But anyways, let's go pick up this McDonald's order. Going very, very fast because it's downhill. McDonald's is just on the left. This is how it is to... Might just pick up a bit more speed. There we go, come up here on the left. It's a red light, but just next to Taco Bell here is McDonald's. I'm gonna park it here because these trees are where the pigeons are, so you can see all the pigeons, the bloody pigeons over there next to McDonald's. So hopefully here I'm a bit safer, but I am under a tree. <laughs> There we go, lock up the bike, peace of mind, 6907, sorry cheers. I got 6907. Uh, 21. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> Great service. Anyway, cheers mate, I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, Did you guys see that? My editor really. Please keep that in. <laughs> he asked for a bag, uh, well, like for it to be packed up, and she just gave him the bags and then <laughs> was trying to get away with it. Oh God, it's McDonald's. They look so happy to be working there, to be honest. But anyways, that's their business. Now, this is a very interesting order because it's only 0.4 miles away. It's four minutes. And I'm going to show you what the pay is. And uh, that used to be a police station over there. It's all boarded up. Ooh, this, a lot of the windows are smashed up. Now, I might get a bit of flack for showing people who work in these restaurants, but, you know, if they actually did their job properly and, you know, provided the service, I think McDonald's would agree with me that uh, that should be the case. And the guy, you know, asked for a bag. He didn't have, <laughs> he shouldn't have to pack it up himself. Oh, wow, it's changed so much in this area. They've built a brand new building just over here. It's very nice, very contrasting because it's a very modern building. And then on the left, you've got the Hogwarts style building. Hi, it's Teresa. Yes, it is. There Thank you, you go. Thank you. Have a good one. Cheers. Cheers. So we made £5.56 on that delivery, which is a bit of an interesting one because I'm getting paid the same for going the same, for going shorter distances. 
I went at least 10 minutes on both of the previous orders. This one just like four minutes around the corner and I got paid £5.56. Now, who was right here? Oh, let's let them go. One thing I noticed when I handed that order over, it was so hot. So the delivery bag here is doing its job. Now you might be wondering why I'm not using a Justy delivery bag. And that's because there are better delivery bags out there and it's not super bright orange, this one. This is a delivery bag from Spartan Pack, which I absolutely love. It is the right size to carry pretty much most orders. Now, the Justy delivery bags uh, are very, very big and very bright and orange. I don't really like that. So I like to have like an unbranded bag. So you can see it's completely black. Um, there's no branding. And that works out for me because I work for, you know, do deliveries for Uber Eats, Deliveroo, Just Eat. Um, when I was saying work for us, actually I'm just doing deliveries for. It kind of feels like I'm an employee, but I'm not, I'm self-employed. So with this bag, because it's unbranded, I can do all the deliveries for the other apps and I don't have to worry about kind of using competitor bags, although, they're not really too fussed about that, but I just like to kind of have the peace of mind and I don't want to be a walking billboard for these delivery app companies. So this next section is for you if you're looking for the best delivery bags on the market. If you're a motorbike user, bicycle, bike, electric bike, or uh, <laughs> someone's playing music, distracting, uh, or even if you're in a car, this next segment is for you. This is the Spartan Pack delivery bag that I use to do all my deliveries completely in black i do like having it in black because a lot of the delivery bags are very vibrant out there and they kind of get attention i like to be a little bit kind of undercover when i'm doing my deliveries and then here on the right you've got netting side netting i've got my towel in there just in case i've got any spillages or hot drinks i can quickly clean that up and then i've got my gloves in this side netting for the winter time and then let's go inside the backpack so Plenty of space here for deliveries. Now, there is quite a lot of space in here. So what I like to do is, I like to have this medium sling from Spartan Pack, so from the same company, and I put it inside of my backpack. It fits really nicely in there. We open this up. As you can see, what I love about this medium sling is that it has a divider. So I can separate food and drinks or just drinks that I put in here. I usually put the drinks at the bottom of my bag in this one to stop them from like spilling and moving around. Then I close that and I put food on top of here and then I close it, zip it up. And that is my delivery backpack setup. I have links to both of these delivery bags in my description. If you use code GeekHustle10, you'll get 10% off. So I'm gonna get a free energy drink from this Rockstar stand i got one earlier but i want to show on camera all right mate just making a video cheers what flavor is this strawberry lime appreciate it thank you oh. i've already got one <laughs> cheers thanks all right so got strawberry and lime i don't really drink energy drinks because they're full of sugar and uh yeah i'm 30 now and I tend to put on weight if i don't look after my health actually i'll whip out the other one Still got no orders. I'm in the middle of Market Square. Let's uh, show you. I... Oh my God, Jesus. Bit of an overreaction. Screaming for no reason. This one's Watermelon Kiwi. I think I'll like that one. But I can't seal them, so I'm just going to keep them in my spot and pack. Oh, come on, we need an order. I would say this road here is the busiest for orders because there's restaurants either side multiple restaurants and i can see a lot of delivery jackets they're all waiting here oh god it's not good it must be very quiet so i'm just waiting outside of mcdonald's as you can see and desperate times calls for desperate measures i've gone online on delivery and i still am not getting any orders so no orders on just the no orders on delivery is a friday it's early evening it's now six o'clock and we've still just made £16.74, which that comes out to pretty much like almost eight, eight pounds something per hour, which minimum wage is like £11.44. So yeah, it's not uh, what I expected. I thought we'll be earning pretty decently, but we're not. How you doing? 
you make it, yeah? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Much, you know? No, 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 it's okay. It's, to be honest, it's very... Want to be famous, you know, no, you won't be, trust me. <laughs> Is, are you getting many orders? Because I'm getting like hardly no, anything. No, no, I just... Like, it was like 15 minutes waiting. Ooh. More even, I think like 20 minutes. How much are you like making per hour, would you say, do you think? Uh, on like a... Before, yeah. Before we make like even 20 per hour. 20 pounds per hour 20, before, 50, yeah. yeah. How long ago? How many years? Like two years ago. A now, few years, yeah. yeah? Now it's like... To be honest, if it's busy, we make 12. Normally, we make 10. And that's if you've got a fast bike. You have a fast bike. Everyone yeah. has, yeah. But this is this is not. This one is uh, 250 yeah. watts, uh, 36 volts. And then the other ones are, uh, what's the motors they're like? That's 1,000 watt motor. Most of them are like 1,000 watt. Yeah. Yeah. They are from but China. I, and I don't, I get it because like, if you don't go fast, you can't even make minimum wage doing this. No, you cannot, yeah. So these motorcycles, everything. Yeah. It's from China. Most of the, the kits yeah, are from China. Yeah, yeah, you assemble them by yourself. You and it's them. quite cheap or? Motor itself costs 200 pounds. Battery is expensive. Okay. The battery costs you like 400 pounds. Including the cost of the bike, how, how much? The bike you can buy. From like Halfords? Bike from, not Halfords, no. It's used one, like used one. good one, yeah. So 200 pounds. So altogether, how much would it cost for like a bike? 900 pounds. It's pretty cheap. Yeah, yeah, you need to be careful because there's a lot of thieves here. Yeah, well, if you don't lock it, that's it, gone. That's why I got this one, man. I have to lock. To be honest, a couple of years ago, I wasn't super worried about my bike getting stolen, but recently. Yeah, people, they told me that they stole my bike. I asked them, do you lock it? No. You deserve yeah, that. yeah, you, you deserve, deserve it. That. Yeah. Not to deserve that, like I'm happy what happens. No, you. but you, you need to lock it. Play a stupid game to get that. Like, I think a lot of people are a bit, uh, they, they think it's safe. It's not. Not safe, yeah. I've got, oh, got an order. i got on Deliveroo. No of, problem, yeah. yeah. Uh, me as well. All right, guys, we have got an order from Deliveroo. Picking up the fillet of fish. Hiya. Oops, excuse me. Cheers. Some chicken nuggets on this one. Uh, boss, I think this one's mine. It's uh, 0 Yeah. Do you mind just starting your journey? Yeah, there you go. Alright, cheers. Thank you. Alright, that was a nice easy pickup. Fire engine here. And I am delivering to hydrogen student accommodation. Deliverer? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Do you have the uh, code? Uh, no. There's a, a code, like a two number? Oh uh, yeah, on the app? Seven, one. seven one. Okay, there you go. Right. Sure, sure. Thank you. Okay, bye bye. So we made £2.95 on that. So you can see very different earnings to Just Eat. Just Eat was double that. And uh, we do have an order from Just Eat because I've just gone back online actually. I'm going to go this way because I am picking up from Just Eat, um, or Just Eat, KFC. Everyone's getting ready for their Friday night. They're having some beers in the pubs here. And let's go pick up this KFC order. Try not to hit anyone. So everyone's enjoying themselves. All this food, it smells. It's making me pretty hungry, okay. Let's go this way. Oh, KFC's just over there though. Oh my God, there's so many riders. You see that? They're just like chilling. <laughs> it's like, should be the busiest time to, to deliver. Oh. Oh, thank you. Thank you. All right, we're picking up from this KFC here. Oh, it's busy in here. 
Oh yeah. You got a seven six nine eight. Uh, oh, the other side. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Cheers. Oh, okay. Excuse me. That's me. That's me. It's chaos in here. Uh, seven six nine eight. Awesome. Thank you. There you go. So this customer's eight minutes away, 1.1 miles. Let's go here. Thank you. So if you're wondering what my thoughts are on doing this work, to be honest, I don't think it's worth doing any more for, for the most part. If you just want to go out, get some exercise, earn a little bit of money, you're not doing it very often, yeah, it's not too bad. Um, but it's not really well paid enough even for me to do that, to be honest. Oh, hi. Yeah, I do. Newcastle. Yeah, yeah, that's me, man. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, yeah. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I've been watching your channel for ages. I saw you, I was like, no, that's him. Yeah, to be honest, I don't do it much anymore. Don't yeah. do it much anymore. Have you been doing it for a while, or? Uh, a few years, a few years. So since, like, pretty much when I started, then? Oh, yeah. Probably. What, what have you seen change? Because that's, for me, like, a the big... It's gone down. I'm not making as much anymore. Why do you think that is? Yeah, down there. So for me, it's one is the delivery apps every single year they're cutting the fees. That's one. But the second is, have you been getting much orders? And the reason being is there's too many people doing it. And why? Why is that? If you, okay, let's be honest. Who are the who are the type of people doing deliveries at the moment? People. <laughs> so there's a lot of immigrants doing it, right? Even like legal, like there's like been over like a million people coming in in 2023. So what happens is, is a lot of them are like low pay, low skill. So they go into this work. Someone just got sprayed with a drink, okay? Uh, so they go into this work because it's easy and they might not have a choice. They might not have it because, you know, if they haven't got the permit, they can deliver it as a substitute. You can Deliveroo, Just the Uber Eats. Renting the accounts online and stuff like that, yeah. Exactly. It's nice to see a perspective of someone who's been doing it for a long time mm. because you're kind of, you kind of see the change, yeah, you know? Yeah. It's noticeable. Yeah. It's yeah, not more, even on a, uh, on a manual bike. Love this man, uh, you're on a manual bike? Wow, props to you, man. It's hard work, but it's to be done. Are you doing this like full time or is it, uh, no? Pretty much. I usually okay. do uh, during the nights. Okay. Who's the best time? Just got rolling. But I usually do it during the nights. Who's the best time? Yeah. Maybe sometimes in the evening, like now as well. Yeah. Well, yo, it's good to see you. It's yeah, no, it's good. I've been watching your YouTube for ages now. But yeah, man. Mate, uh, I'm happy to meet you, but trust me, like, it's probably, this, this work is. It's dying out. You're a smart guy, you'll find something yeah. good. Anyway, I gotta go do this. What was your name? Effie. Effie? Yeah. Alright, Jay. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you, man. Take care. Shout out to Effie. What a lad doing deliveries on a push bike when pretty much all these guys are using a thousand watt motors and that's how they just make 12 pounds an hour. So I don't know how much Effie's making per hour, but probably not that much uh, considering he's on a push bike. You never know, he might be, might be super rapid with his bike. But um, yeah, shout out, he's a nice guy. And Effie, if you're watching, I recommend like not going at this full time. Go, you're a smart guy, you'll find something good for yourself long term. But that's just, uh, that's kind of what I've, oh, red light, oh, well, we can go. Anyways, we've got five minutes to this customer. Let's go deliver this. Hey, is that your car? No. All right. The All right, okay. I, uh, I like the name on the order, Jizzy, is it Jizzy Drake, the, we the best music? <laughs> I made it when I was like 13. <laughs> oh, you've had an account on Justy? Oh, is it Justy? Yeah, it is. Oh, there you go. Thank you. Awesome, have a great one. <laughs> oh wait, do I have anything else? No, I don't. I think it's have a good weekend. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so we made £5.89 on that Just Eat KFC order. And I've paused Just Eat and gone online on delivery and I got a McDonald's order, and you're gonna see the drastic, again, difference in earnings. Check this out, guys. This guy's juggling on a unicycle. Look at this. 
<laughs> oh, I didn't think I would see that. Um, it's funny because that Just Eat customer had Drizzy Drake, We The Best Music, as her account name. She said she got it when she was 11, uh, like 13. She had a Just Eat account when she was 13. Maybe it's an email. Okay, we have made it to McDonald's just over here. This is the Castle Marina one. Park my bike up here. Here I'm here. I got six one four eight. Yeah. Is it both of them? Uh, yes. So I use a small bag. Put that in. Oh, that fits in great. And then. Oh, perfect. There you go. Cheers. Hiya. Hiya. It's uh, Emma. Nice. Right. There's two big bags. Mm -hmm. Food in that one just there. Great, thank you. And things in that one. Is there a two digit code? Uh, 68. 68, awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you. See ya. Bye. Bye. So we made £3.94, that was a pretty good one from a delivery room because it only took me like five minutes to deliver that. It's so random sometimes, these uh, delivery earnings. I wonder how they base it. So we're at Nottingham Station. I have got a train to catch and I have literally like two minutes to catch it, three minutes maybe. Um, let's see how this goes. All right, inbound. All right. Uh, train to Matlock is 6C. Okay, thank you. All right, cheers, mate. So I need to take the lift. Oh, lift, 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 lift. Oh, thank you so much. I think the train's in like two, three minutes. Oh, no. Still got a few minutes, hopefully. Uh, which, what? Train to Matlock. Oh, I'm yeah. going to Birmingham. Oh, it's in Birmingham, yeah. okay. Yeah, Are you from? Minutes, so. Oh, yeah, you can relax, have yeah, a drink. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, worry. Are you off for the weekend now? Or? Um, yeah, I'm going home and I'm going to Spain. So. Oh, enjoy yeah. Spain. Thank you. After you. Thank you. All right, we've still got two minutes. Yeah. Cheers. Uh, where, which coach should I go into for the bike section? It's going to be one of these two middle bikes. Okay, cheers. Oh, there so the seats in here are pretty nice. Like this is a definitely a, a nicer, newer train. You can tell by the seating. And uh, actually, I can just enjoy sitting down. Usually it's absolutely full, but uh, you can see the views outside. It's soon it is going to be summertime. Um, and you're probably wondering how much we made. I'm going to get my earnings up right now for you. Um, so £22.63 on Just Eat. So on delivery we made £6.89. And so if we add that onto our total of Just Eat divided by three hours, comes to £9.84, which is below minimum wage. I think it's below the previous minimum wage. It was £11.44 now and it was like £10.50 or something I think before. So do I recommend doing Just Eat? If you, if you want to earn a few bob and you want to get some exercise, I don't think it's the best work anymore. Um, you can see it from that, it's just, it's not, it's not the, uh, the best, but it's all right, it's not too bad. Um, anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Do not forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.